Wind snapping trees all over our area, causing damage and power outages. CBS 2's Rena Roy joining us live from Englewood, New Jersey, uh, to give us the update on things there. Rena. Well, Dana, as you said, the wind has definitely been causing some serious issues for some people, especially this homeowner. Take a look at this. This tree just came crashing down earlier this afternoon. You can see the mangled branches and leaves taking over her driveway and her home, tearing it up, damaging the backside and shocking neighbors. The siding and the roof of this Genesee Avenue home ripped and tattered after this towering tree split in half, landing on top of it. I've never seen that. Actually, in my life. Neighbors couldn't believe what they heard and what they saw. I hear this thunderous crash, and it was like thunder, but louder. Her whole house was stripped, the tree had fallen, a lot of damage. Tree after tree falling since early this morning across the tri state area. On Clinton Place in Hackensack, a trunk hit this building's facade around 5 15 a.m., and in Passaic, one slammed down into the street. Just fell right between two cars, and luckily no one was injured. I woke up and uh, they told me that there was a tree on my car, and I came outside and I found this. To avoid this happening to you, experts recommend keeping a close eye on older trees, making sure overgrown ones are pruned regularly and if you see any dead branches or signs of rotting get it checked out by an arborist to see if it needs to be cut down falling branches not only cause damage to cars and homes but also power lines pse and g tells us there were several outages in leonia and bloomfield where wires were down and crews are no doubt very busy this evening. PSE&G has extra workers on hand tonight to handle any more outages that may pop up. We're live in Englewood, New Jersey tonight. Rena Roy, CBS 2 News.